Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we thought someone else was going to start the conversation. I guess. Hi. Hi. The end. <laughs> so oh. we are out of the closet thrift. If you have not visited us before, welcome and thank welcome. You. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. My name is Mary and this is my wife, Ashley. Hi. Did you want to continue? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> so we we actually went to our first um, Posh and Sip event today. Um, we have like a local, it's a Facebook page. It's Poshmark Seattle Community. And we just recently joined it because of our friend Denali, who was like, yeah, get on there, get on there. Denali, like, who's okay. El Dutro. Yep, El Dutro. Um, so we did, and they were hosting an event, a posh and sip and thrift event today. So we met for drinks and snacks and goodies and giveaways and all sorts of fun. And then we all went over to the Goodwill bins. The bins! The bins, the bins, the bins! We love the bins, and that's like the majority of how we source but mm -hmm. for some people it was their first time there it was really awesome to be around a bunch of like-minded people and people who have expertise in all different places mm -hmm. um so we had a blast and we, yeah. we just picked up a few things we, it was our first time going for shoes which we've never done before but we figured we have our like tiny but mighty haul and we would just show you guys tiny right but now. Mighty's good yeah right as we got home so if you're interested in any of the items feel free to comment below we'll also post the links to our instagram youtube and our work email so you're welcome to shoot us a message if you're interested in anything yeah okay so on with the shoes we found these amazing clogs they're really cool they're super cute they're kind of like an ivory here and then they have the floral print and then um, you can see on the bottom the bottom is rubber and they're made in Sweden. This Can part's rubber. That? This part's totally wood. And the other, yeah. The otherwise. whole bottom is wood and then it just has like the rubber um, sole like, yeah. for traction and, and stuff. And then the inside is wood. So yeah. these we just thought were an absolute gem. Love they're um, size 39. The brand has been worn off in the heel. Um, the soles are in great condition though. Mm -hmm. um, so if you're interested in those, we're like going to do... legit wood a little bit of research to see if I can figure out what brand they are so I can the only part of the tag that's left says nice and comfortable oh well there you go <laughs> adorable if that's not a selling point um we found these I'm just gonna take one out if just trust me that there's another one um these Michael Kors heels Woo! those are some legit heels they are no I'm sorry I'm awesome. like, I don't like, so close to your face no they're awesome they are they have like a mirrored <laughs> bottom um, they're really fun. They have the platform. I would want my own shoes that close to my face. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile. There you go. Yeah. Love. They're, they're awesome. They have that. They're great. The metal Michael Kors on the back. And they're, and they I think size seven. So I think as well. Said. Sorry, it's I'm holding the phone up weird for the video. So that's why I keep switching arms. I think they're a size seven. But you can see the Michael Kors in there. Cute, cute. Um, and then we got these little gems. They are called Jambu. And they are, you want to, yeah. They're super cute. They have the cute little flowers there, green and white. They have been worn. We're going to clean them up a little bit, um, just to make sure. But the, the, um, soles don't have a ton of wear on them. Yeah. So they're in great shape. They're great for spring coming up. And they're so no, we have two of comfy. each shoe just it isn't just the one yeah we're not one oh as far as size did we talk about what size these were uh -uh. i think i'm gonna have to research that further so well if you're interested in those let me know i can look up a size these just looked so weird that i had to pick them up because i figured they were some kind, of, kind of sports shoe yeah it's kind of our mo if they look a little weird like some kind huh. of athletic shoe so I looked them up uh, by brand, and I and found the exact see they're, like, shoe. Totally smooth on the bottom, and I'm thinking, what sport requires totally smooth soles? You want to know what kind? Yeah, tell us. Rock climbing. Rock climbing shoes. They are vintage '90s rock climbing shoes, booties. Aren't I don't know they what you'd fascinating? call them. Fascinating. Um, but I found the brand is Bariel. Bariel. I don't know how you say it. Bariel. Bariel. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I found those exact shoes 
um, listed, and they are vintage a 90s. Great flip. I can't find the size, so yep. again, we'll do some more research, timer, folks. Uh, Ash found these beauties. They may not make it out. They're they may my not size. Make it out. If you're interested in, in these, you better in let these us know. sick sambas. Real that quick. I think were actually only worn to play indoor to soccer actually once. actually play indoor soccer because the soles are perfect. Yeah. Not. Yeah. They perfect. have. I don't and think they're a size worn. men's 10. ten. Like the inside. I have giant feet. So. Are perfect. Yeah. They're not even a, even a little bit worn. We'll see. And these we grab. Somebody jump on them also quick. So vintage. Kind of for style, kind of for brand. It was Daniel Green. Mm -hmm. They're vintage 90s, like loafers. They've never been worn. They're or kind of maybe denim. like once. Yeah, denim they're kind of like denim. They smell the vintage. Are, you know that smell. It's like a little bit. Not like too, not like mothballs. Not like, no, 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 not like and that. And then the soles are in great shape. So that's fun. Yeah. And those were a size. Guys, I gotta brush up on my shoe haul talk because it's I don't know first what I'm time. doing. Seven and a half. My hair looks crazy. Seven and a half. All right. All right. So that's fun. This was like seriously such a random. We really didn't actually need to go to the bins today. We just wanted to go because we wanted to meet our new friends. Um, and we said we weren't gonna get anything. Yeah. So we we only spent like you twenty bucks. We spent less than went. twenty bucks. So that's cool. Um. Okay. Then we saw this in the hat bin, which I'm assuming just means someone else picked it up and then put it down. But they Could are... Could be. Or... No. <laughs> someone thought it was a hat. Someone was like, wait a minute. It's not a hat. Oh my gosh. Bless her. Bless her heart. I really don't know why she keeps me. Um, They are these but vintage army wool. They're 100% wool. Like, I feel like someone wore these... It like to war. To war. I don't know. They just seem so old. Like look at the. Inside. I think they're from the fifties. Was when I was seen... looking them up. I think they're from the fifties. And I believe these are for suspenders. Yeah, these guys. There's a picture with um, a pair of those with suspenders attached. And the brand is J D Bucking Alsfeld. But yeah, so, so they're definitely more of a real vintage. Sorry. Definitely more of a collector's item. Obviously not for high fashion, but the comps were pretty awesome. And they're yeah. definitely something someone collects. So we snagged them up. We, we made another super random pants sale mm -hmm. of like these. Wool and acrylic hunting pants. Hunting pants. Like again, I, I wouldn't know so them from specific. a hole in the wall. We just happened to look at the, what's sorry. happening? I'm sorry. Look how mad she is at me right now. <gasps> anyway, if. Just check out comps. It's super, I don't know. You That's how we grab, time. like, the most random stuff. Okay. Hopefully you're going to be able to see this. It is a scarf from Aldo. It's ivory, and it has black. Can you see that? Yeah. Right now I can't see a damn thing. Um, yeah. It's got little black birds on it. How so cute. How cute are they? So stinking cute. There's all these, like, different cute. kinds of birds on them. Yeah, really cute. Love. Love. Love these little happy friends. Little sheer ivory. That's such a good for spring purchase. Um, time we fun. do lots of Lularoe. Not lot, not a lot of Lularoe. We do like we sell lots, lots of like. So numbers. right now we have, we have like a lot of nine TC leggings posted. Um, and so these are a one size. They're a cute little pattern. Yeah, they're cute. They have the green background with like orange and um, purple leaves. Yeah, and they're in great shape. I mean, there's no like barely. They're not pilled at all. Mm -mm. So those will go into a lot. I think I have of, like three pairs right now. So I'll just add those to that. And then these are new with tags. They are Universal Thread, which is Target, and I'm currently wearing them on my own legs right now. They're the most comfortable jeans. And these are pink size eight. New with tags and like have this super cute. So cute. The dipped bottom. Dipped bottom. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you can see that really well. There. Yeah, it looks Sorry, I It's hard for me to see. But um, love those. So those are new those with are tags. Those are cute for love spring. Those. That, those are such a good They pink. would be on my body if they weren't a size 8. Um, and then these super cute Palazzo pants that I picked up because I felt like I needed them in my life. But I will, I will give them up. 
<laughs> if someone wants to love them as much as I'm going to love them, <laughs> then I will give them up. They're ASOS. And they are size 12. And they're these like satiny. So cute. Wide uh, legs. I mean, they're just a vacation just for vacation your legs. Vacation pants. That is a vacation for your legs. Look at how happy these are. Oh, I don't know if they're going to make it. I don't know if I can post them. <laughs> if you love these. Let us know. Let us know real quick. Real quick. Um, and that's it. That was our little. That's our mini haul. That's our little mini haul for today. We had a blast. We and did. I definitely encourage you to, if you're a reseller, go find your reseller friends. It's awesome. Like this can be a lonely job. Luckily we have each other. We yeah. have a blast doing it together. We really do. But like we literally sat at a table of like 20 people today and we all talked just about our experiences, about how the business works, about what we've sold, what we've bought. Like it's mm -hmm. really, really fun. So if you're looking yeah. for some friends in this crazy business, then I definitely would recommend come find us. Certainly yeah. if you're in if Seattle, you're in the anywhere Seattle, near, greater Seattle area, let us know. We'll we meet are. you for coffee. We'll meet you at the bins one we day. We love friends. We love friends. True. Both the show and new friends. Oh, God. Make new friends, but keep the old. Mm. One is silver and the other is gold. Anyone? Do you know what that's from? No. It's I mean, I've heard it, but I don't know what it's from. It's from the Girl Scouts. I played sports. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, comment, like, subscribe. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Um, we will be back soon. Hopefully we have a lot of stuff to list. Yes. Um, new lots, new lots coming. Yeah. New, new stuff coming. coming. And that's about it. I Happy think. Sunday. Happy Sunday. We're going to go in and we're going to go hang out with our dog. Woo. Um, and get some more stuff posted and listed and photographed and measured. It's going to be great. All right. Smash that like button. Subscribe. Woo. Reach out to us if you like anything or don't. I don't know. Share this video with your friends. Post it on your page. We do contests on our Instagram. So, um, we, yeah, we do like giveaways all the time. For sure. Give us a follow over there. Um, you'll get some prize packs. So, yeah. Hopefully we'll chat with you guys soon. See ya.